how to contact Skillshare support. Hello friends, welcome to another tutorial. In this video, I will be showing you how you can contact Skillshare support. Okay, so follow me as I show you. The first step is to log in into your Skillshare account, just like I've done here. And then once you're logged in, you will be brought to the page where you would see a number of classes, right? Then, once you can see that, move to the top right corner where you can see your profile icon in between the notifications icon and then um, the start now icon. So, click on your profile icon and then in the drop down menu that we have here, ensure you select account settings. Or in the drop down menu that appears, just scroll down and select the help option. The help option is located. Um, below team plans and above sign out you just click on that so after clicking on the help option you would be taken to the support page automatically so all you need to do is to wait patiently for it to load so once it has loaded you can see skillshare app center and then the next step is for you to scroll down or move to the bottom right corner where you can see the option support and then just click on that. Then after clicking on support, you can now go ahead and ask your question directly and you receive an answer immediately. Or you can just decide to scroll down and move to the left side where you can see the option contact us and then just select that. So after selecting contact us, you'll be taken to the contact us page. So once you're on this page, you can see the different methods here. Majorly, you can use the email address to get in touch or for further information, you can just scroll up just below contact us. You'll see the question, how can I get in touch with Skillshare? Then you select that and then scroll down. Then you can see the general support inquiries, which says to contact our support. You can reach us at help at skillshare.com or you can submit a ticket. But these are the two ways whereby you can reach the Skillshare support team. You can decide to send an email or you can decide to submit a ticket, whichever one for you is fine. And then after sending an email within some hours, response will be sent to you via your email address. The same thing applies to you if you submit a ticket. So these are the ways whereby you can contact the Skillshare support team. I hope this tutorial has helped you. Thank you for watching and have a good day.